1,999.6. I should write around the parking lot. <laughs> there we go. Reset to zero. <clears throat> Take off. Adios. You are leaving now, Kim. fun to be out of reality for you know six or seven weeks uh, and just play. Yeah you have to just be able to focus on all you have to do today is ride from point A to point B. We finish a ride no matter how hard it is and as steep as the hills may be when we get in we smile give each other a high five and say gosh wasn't that a great ride. So yeah you find something new every day when you go out it doesn't matter where you're riding or what you're doing if you look for it it's right there. Riding a bicycle to me is about experiencing the scenery rather than just seeing it. So there are moments when you think, oh, I'm never doing this again. And then two minutes later, it's just wonderful. Uh, I was a little nervous about this ride because I didn't know anybody, whereas I've always gone with friends. But it took me one day and people just bond and we're, we're all here for the same reason. If you can ride a bike, day after day after day and ride at least say maybe 20 miles on those days and on a few of the days ride 40 or 50 miles then you can do this and you don't have to go home and do your laundry you don't have to go home and deal with anything but just you know take a shower and show up for dinner but it's the challenging days that make me feel really good about myself the sag is always a very happy sight when I see that it's like oh yeah I can go see some people, drink some water, get some more stuff, and be on my way. The uh, camaraderie of the women is a lot of fun. You know, it's a very different culture from if we had a mixed group. Um, we do a lot of silly stuff. West Virginia, Mount Mama. Mount Mama, take me home, take me home. Country roads, country roads, take me home. Mount Mama, Mount Mama, Mount Mama. Mount Mama. Everybody seems to be very um, uplifting and uh, cheer each other on and concerned, like today we had rain, who's back, who isn't back, we're worrying about them until they get home. So it's been very affirming, you don't, there's, there's, the egos aren't there. We just rode our bikes 80 miles. If I was about to get in a car and drive 80 miles, to me in the car it's a long journey, and we just rode it. And here we are, still on our feet, still smiling. I think about problems that I have and I solve them. Who needs a therapist when you, when you have a bicycle?